carpet ready. The film behind us, that's him. In real life, he's not a bad guy, he's a good guy. What can you tell us, sir, about how you feel this evening? I mean, this is a big night. Fantastic. Yeah? Fabulous. Fabulous? And blessed. And blessed? Yes. Yes. You remember I agree. this last year? Yeah, this is like all like. Well, less than a year. Yeah. yeah, less than a year. I mean, the fact that you did another film that quickly, it's like, God is on your side. I mean, he is really pushing you through. He's right there. He's right there. Make sure you don't step, I don't step on him. I won't step on him. I need that guy. I need that guy. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> so, so wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a whole minute. So, please introduce yourself, sir. Who are you? I'm Pablo. I'm Pablo. I'm Bobby V. <laughs> Bobby Valentino. Bobby right. Valentino, so. so. How many films have you been in at this point in the album? 14, 15. Stop it! Really? I mean, four or five of it. Oh, okay. Yeah, but, but I've been doing it before, so. Yeah. Nice, you look sharp. I like to get up. This is nice. I hear that. The motherland. The motherland. Let's take it back, right? That's you right there. Okay, so this is round two for you with Mr. Grant, correct? Yes, ma'am. All right, and your name again? Uh, James Goodchild. James Goodchild, good to see you again. So how was this experience with recording this film? A little bit more energetic than last uh, than the last movie. Okay. Yep. okay. What about it was more energetic? Um, there was a lot more scenes for me. Uh, I did a lot more and just felt like I was interacting a lot, a lot more. McLean. Yeah, yeah, I remember I met you last year. I know, that is too dope. No, you're good to go, you're good to go. Yeah, so I heard a lot of people were telling me that you were coming, so they were waiting for you, good to see you. So what was your experience like being here in the film? Okay, in the film, it was it was a fun experience. So, I mean, it was very new to me. It's my first time being on camera in this role, you know. Um, I've done like interviewing, kind of hosting type of stuff, but this is a new type of deal for me. So, But it was really fun. It was really fun. I enjoyed working with Bobby and my mom Moose is, you know, that was a set. <laughs> What's your name? My name is Michael Thomas. Michael Thomas. So do you know the director, Mr. Yeah. Grant? Yeah, he's a, he's great to work with. Um, I'm, I'm Marcus in the movie. Um, yeah, right. okay. I'm, the, I'm the snitch that lives. Like you, uh, I dropped the bomb. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I had to. But, um, but yeah, um, Albert is great. I mean, uh, I met him at, a, at, at the park. I was playing uh, Pokemon Go. Are you serious? That's how you got the role? Yeah, so I went there, I saw him uh, filming and I was like, hey, I was like, are you guys doing YouTube for Pokemon Go? And they were like, no, we're doing a movie. I was like, well, I've been doing theater, you know, throughout uh, Delaware when I was living here. So they were like, you want to be in the movie? And I was like, Stop. yeah, I was like, yeah, yeah. What are the chances of that? Pokemon Go has brought people together. Thank you. <laughs> I think I, sh I think I should get something for that, right? I know. Yeah. Yeah. So. So hold on. Did she say you are in the film? Yeah. This, this thing right here. What? Oh snap! Okay, that's you. I didn't even like put the two and two together. Okay. You were, you were, you were in character. You were in character. So did you have to do anything different to prepare for this role? Like, did they ask you to do anything? Well, originally I was supposed to be an extra, okay. like for the pool scene. Okay. Then I guess he liked me, so he gave me a part. So I have like a couple speaking parts. So I'm excited to see myself on the screen. So you must have really showed your skill set for him to bump you up like that. That's dope. Congratulations. Yeah, right. He's like, oh, put her in there. Give her a role. Give her. Have, how long have you been acting? I had never acted before. It was yeah. So how? Memory, so it's nothing to like learn lines. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So this was just a matter of time before you fell into an acting role. Okay. What was difficult about this? Was there anything difficult about it? I was just nervous because I'm like these cameras are like picking up everything, and I just want to be on point because they're gonna see you on this big screen. So I was just really nervous. Mm -hmm. Who did you have support you through this filming process? Kobe or Albert, whatever you call him, the director, he was really supportive, like helping me learn my lines and he he was really supportive. Like he talked to me all the time and helped me get through it because I was really nervous. So yeah. What was your strategy to memorize your lines? I mean, were you someone that had to go to a certain place, you know, be in a certain environment? 
just reading them over and over and over and recording myself that helped a lot oh, okay. yeah so then recording yourself and then listening back and then giving yourself some pointers that's good to hear I mean that's something you could share with someone that's you know yeah I was like I gotta figure it out if I want to be in this movie you know so okay. well I look forward to see you can you give everyone your name my name's Taylor Great. Thank you, Taylor. I appreciate your interview. Kazaya. Kazaya Finney. Nice to meet you, too. Thank you. Marson Wilson. Okay, and your acting name in this film is? Uh, only thing I do is add my name. I use my regular name. I'm proud of my name. Really? Mm. So he, that is so cool. The only thing I use is the, the voice as an acronym, but okay. I use my regular name. I, I think my mom would have a problem if I didn't. Right, right. <laughs> okay. So in this film, they call you Marshawn. No, no, no. In this film, my name is... Amor? Amor? Yeah. Okay. So what's your role in this film? Can you give us something without telling us too much? Uh, I am the antagonist in here. Oh, yeah. oh God. <laughs> are, you, are you kicking up dirt, basically? A, a, a little bit. Real, 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 real quick and get it out the way. What? <laughs> Messing up a couple situations. You know, <laughs> just, just to sprinkle the dirt just on it and keep it moving. Bit. Okay. Oh, my God. Okay, so what could you tell the viewers about what to expect? What type of film is this? Um, I would say Spectre Unexpected. You got action, you got drama. Um, I, I would say a, a hood romance, but it's not really a hood romance. Okay. So you got a you got a diverse film. It's not the typical urban film. Right. Okay. It's low key. Okay. So I understand you are an actor in this movie, sir. All right. Please let us know your name. My name's Tyrell James. Okay. Yeah. Who do you play in this film? I'm Josh. Josh, Josh, is this guy a uh, good guy, bad guy? Come on, tell me it's a good guy, please. Josh is an okay guy. Josh, um, he a good guy, but he uh, he likes to start a little bit of trouble. Type of Everybody is starting trouble around here in this film. That's what I'm hearing so far. Okay, so go ahead. Go ahead. So I was going to ask you, so the viewers, when they come out to see this movie, what would they expect? I mean, without giving away too much, what would they expect? Um, what should they expect, actually? They should expect to um, be on the edge of the seats, you know. Um, it's suspenseful, and uh, they expect to uh, enjoy a good movie. You know, it's a good movie, it's a good movie. Uh, they definitely like it, and, um, you know, pretty much it's a good film. It's an Albert Green film, so right. it's good. Is this your first time working with Albert? Uh, yeah, my first time working with Albert, yep. Okay. yep, yep. So how did you guys connect? Me and Albert connected, uh, I did acting when I was um, younger and stuff like that. So I, um, so I told Albert, you know, about my past or whatever the case is. And, you know, he gave me a shot for a smaller role, did a good job, landed a bigger role. So I land, I land Josh, yep. That's right, that's yep. right. That means you put in some good work. All those years paid off. Yeah. Okay. okay. Not too many years school work. That's all. So how was that decorating and being, you know, there with? Her? I enjoy doing it. Wonderful. Yes. Yes. How did you get that assignment? Well, just by being nosy. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> Who else do we have here? Hi, how are you nice doing? You. Been spreading the word. I understand that this is a fantastic movie, so we just want to hope this is not the only showing of it. Right, right. Okay. Right. So what and are you I'm proud of her. I know no, 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 no. Her first debut. <laughs> so what are you expecting when you when you know? Do you have any expectations? Did she tell you anything about what was going on? Total surprise. Total surprise. Yeah. Even with decorating the set, did you? Get an understanding of what was going on? No, it's a little bit like me. I always <laughs> know since <it's> something. <laughs> okay. Especially. Right, the gentleman is her husband. Right in the <laughs> All right. Okay. There was a kid that came up here and I said, you know, do you get any idea about something in this film? He said, oh, well, I think she's dating him. Uh, yep, yep. So he pieced it together. That's cool. That's cool. All right. So I guess when he checks this film out, he'll know he was right on the money. Nice. Anything else you'd like to share? Uh, no, nope. we're just excited. So can't wait to see the movie. Well, I'm glad to see everybody out to support. Welcome back. Welcome back. Round two. Is this round two for you with Mr. Brick, Mr. Grant? Yes. Well, actually, maybe like round four. We've done a few of these, but not with premiere-wise, too. Yeah. 
uh, film-wise, there's been a few short films and uh, the two feature links. So for all viewers, can you introduce yourself? What is your name and what's your role in this film? Okay, um, so my name is Mark McCaffrey Jr. Um, my role in this film is Skipper, who I, I guess I can't give you too much information on who Skipper is, but he's a part of the gang. Um, and he's not too trustworthy, I'll tell you that. Yeah, he's a, he's a little sneak. Yeah. What was your inspiration in creating this film? Like, how did you get the vision for this one? You know, was it something you witnessed or saw or experienced, or did this story just pop up? No, what, what actually happened was uh, about three years ago, I, I received an invitation from Sydney, Australia okay. to film a short film. Okay. You know, and. Um, that time I was filming Shot It, okay. I hope you remember. Uh -huh. and, um, yeah. So my appearance was very bad because of the, uh, the role that I was playing in there. I have my hair all messed up and all that, so okay. I said, let me hold on to that. So right after the premiere of Shot It, mm -hmm. I you know, put together a bunch of friends and I said, let's just film this short film. And uh, we got to the set, they said, yo, this story is hot, so let's just you know, do a um, feature film. So that's what happened. But my inspiration was from these people from uh, Sydney, Australia, which yeah. I'm going to be sending this film to them for them yeah. to check it out. So yeah, right. we may be going down there to Sydney. Yes. Nice. Yes. Give us your name. Ashton. Ashton. Okay. Yeah. So how did you know about this film? Do you know the director? Or did somebody tell you about it? Uh, no, Albert. We had a couple classes together in college. Um, he was always so proactive. So, you know, I told him I'd come out and support. Yeah. So that's on you? Yeah. Definitely. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Um, I just want to see, you know, like the thriller. Um, I seen the trailer. I read a little bit about um, what it was about. So, you know, I just want to see a good film. And I know I, I know him personally, so I know it's going to be good. Yeah. He puts his heart into what he does. Like everything. That's just like, you know, it's going to be good. I haven't seen anything other than the trailer myself, so I don't know what to expect. Yeah, Juan. Nice to meet you, Juan. And who are you, sir? Oh, we got it. It's all good. Red and red. Your name, sir? Rich. Rich. Richard. So, do you all know Mr. Grant? Yes, yes I do. Yes, we okay. do. Personally, he's a good guy. Yeah. Definitely a good guy. The fact that he's a, he's a part of the movie, too. Right. Right, right. right. Okay, so how did you get worried about this film? He I got actually, through my... He actually put me deep. This guy right here. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, after he put me deep, I gave it a call. He told me, come, Mr. Grant told me to come down. He said, come join us in our movie, see what this is about. Put me to the situation, my producer introduces me to the situation. And aside from that, I uh, met him. He was a great guy. Yeah, great, he was invited yeah, to the yeah, situation. Okay. And then they yeah, had some for me. Then it's the situation. I'm happy to be here. Yeah. My name is Mako in the movie. Mm -hmm. Aside from that, okay. I want to get a, give a representation to everybody who got me to this point. Yeah, go ahead. Please, shout them out. Just them. Just All the people. There's a lot of people that got me here. Come on up. I like that outfit. Nice. Good, good. How's it going? Yeah, we're doing great. And who is this lovely lady here? His wife. Hey, nice to meet you. Good, good. Great. So are you here just, uh, you know, as a guest to the film? Are you in the film? Do you know anybody? Yeah, we're family. <laughs> yeah, she can answer that question. Better. Okay. She said no. She's not taking that question. Uh uh. No, no, no. Family, because uh, he's my brother in law, so um, that's why you support him. Yeah, I just want we you. You guys look awesome out here. That's nice. You dressed up really nice. So, what do you know about the film? Did, did your brother tell you anything? Like, did he did he tell you the whole story at any point? There's a lot more he told me. I'm here to, like, let's see what's going on. So, I'm just all excited. What did the trailer tell you? I saw the trailer, I was like, I called my wife up, I'm like, Kobe is doing something like, oh, I can't just, it's amazing. I'm just here to like, let's work it out, let's see what's going on. I'll check you out, you got that jacket on. You got that jacket on. This is big business right now. Yeah, so sir, what's your name? Pascoff in the movie. Okay, Pascoff in the movie, and your real name? Devin Burnett. Yeah. So in this movie, what type of role do you play? Oh, I'm the bad guy. Oh, you know, I haven't heard of a good guy yet. Everyone that has came up here. I'm the bad guy. Are you an obvious bad guy? I'm the one who get everything started on another, a level. Another one of these people? 
Yeah. Oh, my. Okay, so why would this film be called Played? I'm, I'm just trying to get your perspective on this title and then the experience you had in recording this film. Because people play people to get where they want to go, you know. Yeah, yeah. Do you think this relates to real life? Definitely. Definitely? Definitely. So any viewer somewhere should be able to say, wow, this, this kind of relates. Any viewer that watches it is going to understand and they've probably been through a certain type of situation. So This is a relatable movie from one angle or the other, one character or the other. Wow. wow. I'm telling you. Oh, man. What was a challenging piece? Was there anything challenging about this role or um, anything that you had to kind of step out of yourself for? So usually, sorry, usually I'm not like an angry person. So when I had to play like the angry role, it, that kind of was I had to go in a different space. So, yeah. What did you pull from? Like what took you there? I guess just trying to make it a real life situation. So, you know, real life serious type of situation. If, if it were, you know, my husband in that situation, if I felt you know how I felt in that that time frame so have you ever taken acting classes or did you just you just have this skill well hopefully it is a good skill and we'll see tonight <laughs> and then I can say it's a good skill and, and it's just you know born in me so <laughs> thank you thank you see ya thank I love you. that who picked this one out I did you picked this dress out you have really good taste. <laughs> Thank you. Wow, so give us your name. What's your name? My name's Amy. Okay, no Avery? Amy. Amy. Amy, nice to see you again. Thank you. So how do you feel about this film? Your dad putting on this film tonight. I feel it's going to be really great. Really great? Have you seen it yet? Some parts. Okay. So you're finally getting to see the whole thing? Yeah. Oh my. Are you going to tell your friends about it? Yeah. Yeah? That is too cool. Maybe they could get their parents to come out and see it. Yeah. That would be nice. All right. Do you want to give any words for your father? Uh, I want to say that he did a good job on this movie and he worked really hard. That is good. I know he's glad to have you as a supporter. Thank you so much. Enjoy the film. Okay. All right. <laughs> You're so decked out, I can't miss you right now. What's your name, sir? Chris. Chris. Broker. Mm -hmm. Okay. So who are you here to support? Are you in the film? you have anything to do with it? Or did you, are you a fan of Albert's work? I'm in the film. What? Okay, so what's your role? Getting knocked out. Oh, this is getting mad. You got knocked out. So did you get played? Yeah, I got played on this one. Did you play anybody before you got played? No, I ain't play anybody. Oh, you just lost. This is all. Oh. Okay, when you took the fall, did you really take the fall? I took the fall. I had to take it for granted. Did it hurt? It hurt a little bit. <laughs> did he put a cushion down so it would... put no cushion. I just <laughs> fell on concrete. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yo, this is for the team. He took one for the team. That's outstanding. What can you say to anyone that wants to come see this film? It'd be a good film to watch. Okay. And just represent Grant, that's all. Thank you for coming out. Thank you for being a part of the film. All right. So what's your name? My name My name's Thomas. Thomas. Mm -hmm. How you doing? So do you know somebody in this film or did you just hear about this film and you're coming out to watch it? Well, my brother has something to do with it. I actually just found out about it today. So I was like, let me just slide down and see what's going on. You know, he said it was about a, you know, homie and his, his friend got played him and whatnot. So I was like, all right, I'll come check it out. So, so hopefully it's good because, you know, I don't do movie theaters like that. So, you know, check it out. So to get you out, it must have been, you know, a good little sale when he gave it to you, right? Support, you know, and support. support the right. What's your brother's name? Jamal. Jamal Wilkerson. Name, please. Oh, my name is Denise Scott, an actress. I like being an actress, or international, if I may say. Oh, nice. <laughs> Thank you. So you come out as a supporter this evening? Yes, actually, I came to grace the occasion. Okay. Mm -hmm. Nice. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Thank you. So what do you know about this film? Well... Nothing, but the thing is, it is inspiring. He told me a little bit about it, but I'm yet to see the full story, you know. So he didn't tell you everything? He just gave me the gist, because he wanted me to come, and I'm you here. Know about his role? Did he tell you that? No, he didn't specify. Yeah. It's a did surprise. He show, did he show you the trailer? Um, actually, he did, but I've been so basic, I didn't get to see it, I'm not going to lie. So this is a full surprise when you get Well, it. yes, it is. Nice. Okay, well, I'd love to hear what you think about it. Oh, sure. How you doing? Hey, you. Good. What's your name? Uh, Chris. Chris and Chris. Yeah, two Chris's, yeah. Do you know this guy? 
Yeah, I know that guy a little bit. Okay. <laughs> okay, so are you out here as a supporter or were you part of the film? I was part of the film. I had a role in the film, yeah. Did you get knocked out? No, I didn't get knocked out in the film, yeah. Did you get shot? I didn't get shot. Well, I did get shot. I, I did get shot. I, loved I, shot. I, I, I died. Yeah. I, I died in the movie. I died in the movie. Yeah, I died in the movie. Yeah. See you today. That's outstanding. It's still living right, still now. Living right now. Glad it was just a movie. Yeah, just That's a awesome. So, how was it working with Mr. Grant? It was good, man. It was a good experience working with him. He did this thing doing the movie. I was I'm proud of the work that we did. Yeah. Yeah. How did you get your role? Like, did you know him from years ago? Uh, well, I know him. He's one of my coworkers. I know him. So yeah, I was extra in the movie helping him out. Yeah. So I had a lot of fun doing it. Yeah. Yeah. Any late nights, early mornings? Uh, a lot of them. Really? Early morning, late nights, look. How long did it take to film this? Uh, I know some scenes we was out there for like two or three hours, depending on the scene, yeah. So was this like a six-month, year project? How long do you think it took all together? Uh, I know at least it took six months. might have been close to a year, but okay. yeah. Put a lot of time into it. Okay. Who do you want to shout out? Anybody special you want to shout out? Uh, give a shout out to my wife, Chess. She's right oh, there. Yes, she, got to shout out the wife. <laughs> Come on, put her on camera. She came out here to support me, yeah, yeah. Yep. I know she's proud. All right, cool. All right, cool. thank you. Have a good one. Right? You too. Yep. Enjoy. So who do we have here? My name is Adama. That's one of my kids, you know. Nice okay. to meet you, too. How do you feel about this film? Good. Did you see it yet? I did on, like, Facebook. Oh, go ahead now. And especially, he's my uncle. Nice. So what do you call him? I call him Uncle Kobiko. Oh, that's precious. Uncle Kobe Go. Nice. I know you're proud of him. You have any words you want to say to him? Well, I have one word to say to him. Like, I like his shows and stuff like that. The first one, it was at our old, old house. Yeah. Yes, yes. So you saw that one, too? While he was filming, I went downstairs and I was like, what? <laughs> so I just ran back upstairs and my brother was like, eh. <laughs> so you're a big fan. Cool, we're well, glad to have you here. Sir, you're in the film. What's your name? My name's Troy Giddings, my second film, yes. Okay. Second film with Grant? Grant. Get out of here, so how's that going? It's going good, it's going good, the relationship's going good. Yeah. Um, I feel real good about this film. I play a up and coming hitman in this film, yeah. So I'm excited. So are you causing trouble? Basically, I'm starting it. I'm starting it. I wasn't trying to, but in this film, I am starting a little bit of trouble. Here's my girlfriend right here. Come on in. We need to meet you. Yeah. She does, she don't want to talk, but I just wanted her to be by my side. That's all. You need her by your side always. Can you introduce yourself? Can we get that? Gina. Gina. Nice to meet you. All right. So. How was it having him be a part of this film and you having to support him in that? Like, how was that for you? I mean, he spent a lot of time doing it, so it was time away from me, but that's okay. He loves it, so it was cool. Everyone needs a supporter. Everyone needs a rider. That's outstanding. So what do you expect to see in this film? It's kind of going to be a surprise, I guess. I know he has a couple scenes, yeah. Did he tell you about it? Like, did he? Okay. Bits and pieces. But you don't know the whole story yet. Get out! You were able to hold that all this time. Yeah, I had to. I had to keep the secret. You know, keep them on their toes. Right. Hopefully, the fans come out and enjoy themselves for this film. That's awesome. And uh, we got some surprises in there, so stay tuned. Okay. Thank you so much. And can we please? I'm Nuruddin Sunny. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, are you just coming out as a viewer, or were you in the film, or had a part in the film, or how is it? I'm just coming to watch this event. Oh, yeah. Wow. Who, who told you about this event? How'd you get word about it? Bobby Valentino. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Cool. That is nice. So what do you know about it? Anything? Well, I haven't seen anything about the film. Um, he just told me about it because, you know, he was in Liberia. I'm from Liberia. Okay. Shout out to Liberia. Yeah. Liberia in the house. <laughs> in the house. <laughs> yeah. yeah, Liberia in the house. Um, so when he came, he told us about this project he was working on. And I told him I was going to be coming to the States for a visit. Yeah, so I, I told him I have to see this film. Yeah, I have to see this film right here. Yeah, so you came at the right time. When you headed back? Uh, next week. Next week Saturday, I'll be flying back. Yeah. How perfect is that? Yeah. That's outstanding. Right. Yeah. Timing is really good. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. So how do you know him exactly? Um, he started the industry, and then when he started the industry, he came to Liberian to us because at first we didn't know that he was in the acting industry. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We just thought that he was just um working and doing regular job 
Um, he got out in his industry. So when he came to Liberia, he told us that he started acting. Okay. He brought a couple of movies. In fact, before he brought his movies, you know, we, we run a TV station in Liberia. Oh, okay. um, so he did a movie called Somewhere in Baltimore. Okay. And then we broadcasted that film. And we broadcasted it. I'm like, this guy should be like a Liberian, you know, I think. So when he came to Liberia, I met him. He said, yeah, I acted in some way in Baltimore. I said, wow, you did extremely well. And then he, he brought a couple of his films and he started telling us that, okay, I've been acting and I'm pushing this thing to another level. I'm like, wow. So we need to keep supporting the work yeah, back home. So most of his works that he's done, we try to broadcast them and so that Liberians can get to know that they have an a emerging yeah, a star yeah in the States, yeah. Mm -hmm. So eventually this one is going to end up in Liberia as well. Definitely. We love the connections. That's outstanding. Shout out to Liberia. Yeah, yeah. Light TV in the house. All right. <laughs> yeah. Well, thank you so much for the interview. I appreciate it. Enjoy the film. All right. All right. They're right here. Wait a minute. So introduce, introduce your supporters, please. This is my friend, Nashia, and, and her cousin. <laughs> They came out to support her. my best friend. She's not here yet. She's late as usual, but she'll be here too. You ladies showed up red carpet ready. You hear me? That is great. So how did it feel knowing that your friend was in this film? And I actually found out months ago. So I was telling her, she probably thought I was going to forget. But I was like, I don't care what I'm doing. I'm making it available mm -hmm. for her because it's like a big she experience. Was it. She was like, yeah. make sure you let me know when And I'm, I'm a busy person, but... I got and she and she brought somebody out like that's big. <laughs> so so did you know her beforehand? Nope. You know what? Now that's big. Right. Well, so your your word must really matter because if you could tell her come see this film and they never met, that's a big deal. What do you expect to see in this film? I'm not really sure, but I mean, it looks good. It looks good. I mean, it looks good. Okay. 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 What would you like to say this time around? Oh, um, <laughs> but do you know who she is? Come on now, come on now. She, she is the woman behind everything. You know? I know. You know how they, they have a saying called um, behind every uh, successful man, there is a, a strong, mm -hmm. that's it right here. I know. That's my beautiful wife. I know. Yeah. You got to be strong. She wanted me to introduce her before she can say hello to everyone. So there she is. Be. Yeah. There we go. go yeah. There we go. Interview. <laughs> Well, Lord, don't tell you. them how I stay up 24 7. Oh, right, right. Well, um. Did you see this entire film yet? I've seen his editing. You did, you did. So, when he's sitting down and he's doing all this deep editing, right, do you sit with him or are you just like checking with him every now and then? I help him out. <laughs> That's a supporter right there. If, I mean, so do y'all snack while he's editing? Like, I mean, y'all, you know, sit down and get a couple snacks. Like, how's it go? I can help you out. I, do, I, I give him my insight. I do. I do. You give it insight? Yeah, I do. Okay. Um, nice. He did a very good job. Um, long hours, time away from family, right. and I get mad all the time. I, I said, put, take, take a break. Take a break. Not today. Not today. Right. You're right. But Just take a day off. He don't know okay. how to take a day off. He don't know how to take a day off. That's a hard he worker. Off and he was running up and down, just doing stuff for this. I'm like, come on, you're on vacation. So did you ladies go in, take a seat for a little bit, and then come out? Yes, yeah. we did. Okay. Did you did you eat your, your snacks and all that already? I'm almost tearing my popcorn up before this interview. <laughs> <laughs> I had to go back for a refill, maybe. What's your name? Chanel. Chanel. And you? Brianna. Brianna. So nice ticket supporters. <laughs> So who do you know that's a part of this film? Uh, my brother's on that. Mm -hmm. yeah. Which guy is your brother? Uh, he's not even out here. I think he left us. I think he might be already inside. Dewan. 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 Yeah. Magic. Magic. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> do you know anything about his role? No. So this is kind of like, yeah. We're... I know in the commercial he got shot in the head. How'd you feel about that? Um, as long as it wasn't real life, I'm right, cool. Yeah. Do you think he got played based off of that? He got played, but he's excited about it, so we're excited about yeah. it. Okay. Even though he got it's all good. It's all good. All right. Definitely proud. Yeah. So I'm is this his? To, I'm excited to see the movie. I'm like ready to be entertained. I know. You were here way early, like ready to get in, like. Seven. And then we saw the ticket, and we were like, oh. Yeah. Eight. Yeah. <laughs> You wanted to make sure you got here. Right, right. One of those tricks. I know those tricks. 
That's cool. So what do you right? Right, come on, come on in, come on in. Who's this? It's a setup. Who is this? Hey girl, how you doing? We're great. We're just gonna act like none of these cameras are here. This mic isn't even really here, right? So who are you out here to support today? We're supporting Team Phoenix, Marcel Wilson. Oh, that is outstanding. I interviewed him earlier. His daughter is so proud. And you are you related? No, he trains us. So we work on he did what? Hold on, say that again. He he's a personal trainer. So he's an actor and a personal trainer. Get out of here. Does he, does he have a name for his company? Like, is it a company name? Phoenix. I love it. That is outstanding. He got his hands busy. All right, so what, do you, what can you say about him as a person that we need to know? He's got a lot going on. He's a talented brother. Yeah. Do you know anything about the film? Did you see the trailer? I think he gets killed. Oh, man. No. <laughs> spoiler, no. Wait, wait, spoiler alert. <laughs> based on the trailer. Based, based on the trailer. On the trailer. Oh. <laughs> so do you think he's the bad guy or do you think he's like, you know, innocent bystander type of situation? I think he might be on a villain, maybe. Yeah, I'm not like sure, but guy. yeah. Wow. Do you have anything to say to your fans or anyone uh, that hasn't seen it yet? Yeah, no, I just want to thank everybody for coming, and um, okay. I hope to see you guys over there. We, you know, kind of run out of time, so yeah. I will see you guys All right. in about uh, ten minutes. All right, for the Q yeah, Q and A later, maybe. Okay, right, thank you. All right, see you. Let's. Can you share with us your name? My name is Bento Romeyes. Nice to see you out here. How do you feel about this film? I feel very good. Yeah. Proud of him. Yeah. Did you see this yet? I saw it on Facebook. So just the trailer. Yes. You and I both. That's all we got is the trailer. So we need to get in there so we can see this. Right? Yeah, let's go do it. <laughs> all right. How do you feel? Uh, I don't know yet. I'm Not just yet. waiting. <laughs> yep. So were you were you able to see the film at home yet? I did, but I haven't seen like the whole film. You're, you're kind of where we are. Yes. Nice. Let's get ready to go in and check out the film. Come on. We need to see. And a and, and lady right here. I know. Come on, we, we need her to get this done. Round of applause for Mother or Mother's Day coming. Happy Mother's Day. How do you feel about this? Having a Mother's Day? I'm very proud of Yes, yes. I'm very proud of you. Definitely need to be the This needs to be the last interview. The mom, she caps this whole thing off. Thank you so much for coming out. Thank you for everything you instilled in Albert to get this done. We appreciate you. All right, let's go watch Blade. Thank you.